who down in Whoville like Christmas a lot. But the Grinch who lived just north of Whoville did not. Wait, you're not here for this. You're not here for this or my dope mug. Let's take a little sip here. You're here to find out our first annual 2023 nice list. There's no roasting in this video. I want to go through our curated list of the products that we use in 2023 in the shop, what we tested from the beginning of January to now. So if you're watching this on Christmas Eve, Merry Christmas, get the Grinch out of you. Bro, bro, there can only be one Grinch, okay? Jim Carrey did it the best. Get the Grinch out of your life and let's go through this test. Another sip, thank you to my wife. Ah, that burns. All right, the first, the first, first, first. Oh, 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 oh. I want to talk about rinseless washes. Now, we all know rinseless washes has been a long time. We had a lot of bangers this year, a lot of bangers. I'm going to go over my top three rinseless washes of 2023 that I've used and that I appreciate. Uh, we're going to go over one, two, three. Um, you can make your own decision on where they fall on your list. Just for me, these are what I pick up. Uh, and this is what I grab first, and I'll tell you the why. First one, HydroSafe. Now, if you don't know what HydroSafe is, this is a new rinseless that was released in 2023 by Labo Cosmetica. It's a polymer-based rinseless. You're gonna ask two questions. Eddie, does it leave protection behind? No, Eddie, does it leave polymers? Yeah. Uh, let's talk about like uh, Absolute, o r version three, o r version four and five. Those left polymers behind. It's a cleaning solution. It's pH neutral. Uh, it smells amazing. And it's slicker than me in a Christmas suit with grease on my stomach going down the highway. This stuff is slick. Uh, I wanted to talk about this bad boy. Haven't mentioned it much because the one thing that was fatal for it, we're talking about Drive Hybrid Flex Wash, Drive Auto Appearance, Hybrid Flex Wash. What was detrimental to this was the smell. I'm a very smell oriented guy. Look at my, look at my body. Look, if, you're, if you're watching this video and you see a fat Latino with the red lights, tree, you know he eats good. You know what I'm saying? This needed to change a bit to make it to top three. And so far, really, really enjoying this. Um, it's a hybrid surfactant. Uh, you can use it one to 20 as a pre-wash. You can use it one to 256 in the bucket. Um, and it smells like light grapes. Doesn't do anything other than clean, cleans well, has nothing behind. Let's talk about this bad boy. Uh, I'm gonna put his face here. Merry Christmas, Ivan. I'm gonna put his face here. Merry Christmas, Nick. They came out with this. Ivan is the loved, he's the beloved. Ivan the beloved. Uh, we know Ivan from the o &R days. That guy makes great stuff. This princess wash is amazing. It smells like apples. Uh, I remember my first video I did in 2023, uh, in 2022 actually, the end of 2022 when this came out, we used about two and a half gallons in our shop this year. And remember I had to take a, a sabbatical because my wife got sick. But these are my top three rinses washes of 2023. You could get these anywhere. This one, good luck getting it. Uh, they're making it now, it should hit the state soon. But this one, these three, uh, links will be in the description below. So video's gonna be a long one, so grab yourself a cup of Joe, take the Grinch out, relax if you didn't get what you wanted in life. Remember, you have a life. So if you're watching this, you have a lot to be thankful for. Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah. My next category that I wanna talk about was soap. Now, in the world of soaps, there's many applications. Would you agree with me? Yeah, of course you would, JB. We have like a bucket soap, a regular soap. We have a pre-foam. We, um, we have a bunch of categories that you can use soap for. We have a high pH soap, a acidic soap. I'm gonna show you three categories that we use in the shop lately. Usually go off the cuff. These are my regular soaps in the order that I love them the most. What I mean by soaps is I could pick these up and do anything I want with them. I could actually use it for a full wash. I could use it for the bucket. I could use it for whatever I want, but I'm gonna give you categories in this list of my nice of pre-foam, decon, acidic. Now, these three soaps hit the list this year. I just tested Double Tap. Double Tap is from Lithium Auto. It's a pH user soap. It has uh, a eucalyptus smell. It has a lot of cleaning power, and it also does a lot of cool things. It uses natural ingredients, avocados, and it smells like, it smells like God just peed in the cup and I lathered it on my body. I love the soap for loose brisk. Uh, there's some things that you have to notice for a soap. You don't have to use the full three ounces for a bucket. You can use two and get away with it. This is an amazing soap. Lithium auto wash, busting soap. I wanna talk about this one. Uh, and you're like, Eddie, what order are you ranking these? In the order that I rank them, it's an order that I picked them up first. 
So you make the decisions, one, two, three, okay? Uh, we're gonna talk about, well, that's a lie. Okay, let's take a step back, take a step back. So I'm gonna rank these soaps in the way I picked them up in my favorite soap, one, two, three. So in number three, Apex Auto Wash. Uh, Apex Auto Wash is from Phoenix CLD. Tim and JB sent me this. What I love about the soap is hydro, hy uh, hyper concentrated. It is affordable. There's no scent, so you don't have to worry about smelling raunchy or anything like that. But it also has great, great cleaning. Love this soap. Uh, good job, Aaron, on making that soap. Um, we're gonna do Double Tap. Double Tap, phenomenal soap. Love the cleaning ability, love the smell. When you use this at home and your wife comes out, get ready boys, cause she's gonna wanna smell your neck. You know where I'm going with this, okay? All right, so great soap. Uh, and then we're gonna add Incredible Suds. The cool thing about Incredible Suds is a pH of eight. You could actually use it as a pre-foam. You could use it as a bucket soap. You could use it as just an everyday maintenance soap. I didn't put this as my high pH soap for the category, cause as a soap for one ounce, it's very economical and it cleans well. And then if you don't know what the scent of Incredible Suds is, I'll tell you now, it gives you a berry scent. So those are my top three soaps uh, for 2023 that made the nice list. Um, I do have an award that I'm gonna give out for some of these chemicals that are called Get It Now Award of 2023. Foam uh, soaps, what's a pre-foam for, Eddie? What, what's all this soap? Oh, can I just use one? You can just use one. You can use any soap as a pre-foam. You just have to let it sit longer. What I did with these soaps is that they have a little higher uh, pH and they have a cleaning detergents in it that will allow it for me to use uh, as a pre-foam, and I've used these. There's some of them here that's been around for a long, long time. Some of here are new to me. Uh, we'll go through them. So my number one pick for 2023 is NV Snow Plus. NV Snow Plus, uh, you can find this at parkscarcare.net. I love how it cleans. Does it smell good? Absolutely dookie. Uh, as a pre-soap or a pre-foam, it's amazing, it's tremendous. I do love this soap very much. I let it sit for about five minutes, spray it off, and I can go into my bucket wash, and uh, I'll use another soap that I showed you before this. My next number two is Maniac Prefoam. I do want to thank Ricky for this. When I started this YouTube journey, there was a couple people that I really uh, just started jiving with, really started making a relationship with, Ricky, Tim, Harold, uh, Jamie the Cleaner, JB, uh, Brad, DJ, Ivan, Nick. Man, the list goes on and on, Salvatore. Uh, Sock, I mean, as Ulysses, half these people have been in my house, half of them they not, but he sent me this when Maniac first started coming to the States and I did my first video. This stuff right here, absolutely amazing, wild. Why didn't you put it above this, Eddie? Uh, I didn't put it above MV because I liked how, for now, how MV is accessible. Uh, this isn't in, in distributed in the States yet, but Dave does a good job sending it in the States. The cleaning ability is just as good. Uh, it does foam. You can it does. Uh, you can do a one to five, one to ten in a uh, foam cannon. It's good to go. This one I put about two or three ounces in a foam cannon. Let it ride. The next third on my list is G Technic G Wash. If you haven't used the soap, stuff is busting. Uh, it does have an amazing cherry smell, but doesn't all soaps? Shout out to Coach Kemi. It does have an amazing soap. The cool thing about this is uh, it's. Uh, it has some technology in it that helps the dirt just pull off. I think a lot of these soaps do, but I do love this as a pre-foam. I put it on, let it sit, it cleans. I use about two and a half ounces. I got this at Car Supplies Warehouse. This stuff is amazing. So these are my top three on the nice list for pre-foams. High alkaline soap, number one on my list. It's gonna be hard to dethrone this beast. It's called Primus 2.0. Primus 2.0 is the high alkaline shampoo. Uh, you can mix it one to 10 in a sprayer, put it on first, you take that solution, pour it right in the bucket, foam it on with the same solution, sits on a paint. It's probably some of the best high pH soap I have ever used. Primus from Labo Cosmetica, I take the number one spot. On my list is Armor Detail Supply, Decon. This stuff is tremendous. Uh, Decon is a high pH soap. This is new to the block. Uh, you let it sit for about two or three minutes and you could also do a bucket wash. Stuff is affordable as a pre-soak. Um, I, I mean, as a, a high alkaline soap, stuff is great. It does have a faint cherry smell. Next on my list is Citron. I wanna thank Ricky again for sending me this from Florida. This was during the time where it was sold out everywhere. You couldn't get this crap if you paid my mom 50 bucks to drop. Dude, this stuff was hard to get, like good credit scores in 2024. This stuff is tremendous. I didn't put this as number one for two reasons. Uh, 
I want the ability to get gallons for now. These are the only two that I could get gallons for. Uh, I want the ability for it to smell good. Prima smells good, it works good. And I would say that Primus works as good or better than Decon. And I say Decon, long term for me, is easier to get, more affordable per gallon if you look at cost, but it's also, it also works a little bit better than um, the Citron. So those were my picks. So these are my top three picks uh, for 2023 on the nice list. I did put this as the Get It Now Award for 2023. There's gonna be some categories where I say Get It Now that there's no other glass cleaner that I loved or no other items that I loved and there might be one in that category and I'll explain the reason, but this is Get It Now. If you can get your hands on this, get it now. Use uh, EC15, get 15% off of this. I don't make commission off of it. This stuff, phenomenal. We're about 10% away from being done in the video. Don't leave yet, we have a lot going on here. There might be uh, some type of giveaway we do. I wanna go over my fair acidic shampoo. Now what an acidic shampoo does, it takes you perform it on the car, it breaks down lime scale, mineral buildup, water buildup when you have high TDS in your water. Uh, you usually use that in between either getting ready for a ceramic coating or you're gonna clean up a ceramic coating to get it to pop again and get it back to hydrophobics. I wanna go over my top three, number one pick. Uh, yeah, my number one pick is Perifica from Labo Cosmetica. This actually got the award for the Get It Now Award. This stuff is phenomenal. There's a video I'm gonna link to below where they talk, where they did a test with some of these brands and Perifica, where they use mineral tablets. And what they did in that test that was so unique is that the mineral tablets uh, would show the pH of the chemical after it hits the minerals. This was the only chemical in this test that stayed at a five, which is acidic. And that's good to know because you want the chemical to work for you. We're not using more. Uh, I put number two as D-Scale from CarPro. D-Scale is an amazing acidic shampoo. It's, a, it's an acid level of six. Uh, it does turn the pH neutral after it hits minerals, but it does have great ability to declog a coating. And then my last but not least, I only use this four times. Uh, I was gonna use Adam's Strip Wash, but I didn't feel like Adam's Strip Wash did as good as Reactivate. RS uh, is stout. When it, hits the, when it hits the body, I think it's pH of two or three, it's wild. Um, it does neutralize after a time. The reason I didn't choose this first over Primus or over Perifica is because Perifica actually does a lot better job on the surface long-term. So those are my top three. And this is tire dressings. Tire dressings are used to give your shoes that pop. Some of it uh, re rehydrate the rubber. Some of it has a sheen gloss and then some of them are extreme gloss. So people like that don't look for one for years. This one is hard to beat. This is NV Onyx. What I love about this is the last long time. Minimal slinging, you do have to let it drop. Um, it has a sheen close to a matte look, but it's a nice sheen on the tire. Uh, this stuff is phenomenal. This is number one in my book, uh, NV Car Care. Uh, my number two is uh, Tire Plus from ADS. It's a great, great, great uh, tire it's a great tire dressing. It's got a great smell. It lasts a long time and I love the look that it gives. It gives it almost the same sheen as Onyx. Uh, and then the tire lotion from DIY, it's awesome. It gives me remnants of what I'm looking for for the in-betweens, for the every wash, for um, customer comes in for a maintenance wash monthly, weekly or whatever. I use this because I, I see that it gets about two to three weeks of long lasting protection and gives that nice, O and me look on the tire. This is beautiful. I, this stuff is beautiful. Uh, these are my top three for tire dressings. Now, again, these are my pick. This is what we use in the shop. This is probably like the second container I went through this. This sucker's huge. Next category we're gonna discuss is interior cleaning. There's a few things I wanna get out of the way. There's some honorable mentions that I wanna talk about. It's important for me to say this. It's Griot's interior cleaner, amazing. Um, why didn't it make the list? I found these to clean better for me long-term and I liked the look. Now, remember these, this test here, I had to get a vote on because my daughters do the interior of our car and these are the ones that they picked and these are the ones that I agreed with. When you think Griots, I think of Lux Cockpit Cleaner from Drive, honorable mentions, my number one pick as of late, this is my second bottle. I have another one in the garage. I was supposed to have a gallon coming, I forgive you McKinney. McKinney, I forgive you. Uh, this is Hyper Cleanse. Let's talk about this unique uh, little beast here. Hyper Cleanse is an all surface cleaner. It, it could, it's, when I say that is, 
It cleans carpets, it cleans leather, it cl cleans everything. I could, if I need to a one and done for the whole car, permanently at EC Details, I would go with Hyper Cleanse as my one and done because it could do all of it and the smell isn't too potent over time. Um, it cleans well, it leaves the surface looking great. And the thing about it is it works on leather, not just the fake leather, I'm talking about like the alpha male leathers, the nice premium leathers on the thing, uh, softens it up, makes it good. My second pick, shout out to Wanda Cologne. She asked Owner's Pride Damon and team for this for her birthday. We, I don't know, I don't know why. <laughs> I told her I could just buy it for, she's like, no dad, I want them to send it. Uh, Spiffy is tremendous. If you haven't had the opportunity to try OP Spiffy, what it brings to the table is the cleaning ability, the smell, and then it has this awesome way of leaving the plastics darkening. Like it doesn't leave protection behind, but it does have like UV, UV stuff that makes it amazing. I have used this on seats. I have used it on fabrics. This does a slightly better job in cleaning fabrics uh, for me, um, but Spiffy's number two. The third uh, is Omnia from Labo Cosmetica. Omnia is an interior cleaner APC. It's PFSA or PFAS, um, so it doesn't have harsh chemicals in it. It's VDA certified, um, so it does clean amazing. Why didn't it make number one, Eddie? Because every time I used Hyper Cleanse since they sent me the first bottle, I've been in love with it. So Isabel loves it. It just works for me. So these are my top three for interior cleaning. Um, and then we'll get to our next topic. Another, our next category is interior detailer. Eddie, what's the difference between interior detailer and an interior cleaner? Great question, Sock. Grab a seat, okay? Leave the concrete stuff alone. Let's talk for a second. An interior detailer are for those cleans or those interiors that come in, have light dirt, doesn't require full on cleaning, so you wanna do a one step, essentially. So you can use it, clean it, and it leaves behind protection, UV protection and it's a quick one and done. So I would do this for the maintenance washes. I would do this for the clients that come in their cars not that bad, right? So an interior cleaner is for those that you're gonna need a hammer for the nail, right? You're gonna have to put a little more cleaning power into it. Uh, you want it to clean all surfaces or you want it to clean carpet and things of that nature. But I wanna go over my first one. Um, I'm gonna get a lot of hate for this. This doesn't have a smell, which is unfortunate because I think about other ones out there like Cruise or Barrels that has a smell for interior cleaning. And then you're like, Eddie, why'd you give it number one? Because I could get away with not having the smell, but I love the look. Away with this for Drive Auto Appearance Lux Cop Fit Detailer. It gives me a matte finish, matte. No satin, no grease finish. Gives me a matte finish. And sometimes I just want that matte on me look. Uh, the second on my list here is Lithium Inner Space. Good luck finding this. Been sold out for a while. I know why, it smells amazing. It leaves, back a, leaves a nice sheen. It doesn't overcompensate, right? You don't want it to be so greasy like my Puerto Rican dad who uses Armor All, but you want it to have that look or a darkening rich effect. This is pretty busting and it doesn't take a lot to remove. Uh, my third uh, pick in the category is Interior Clean and Protect from, from DIY Detail. I picked this last out of the slew of ones that I had, because it was Cruise. Man, there was a whole bunch of interior uh, cleaning protects that I've used. This one for me, I like the smell. I like the cleaning. Uh, sometimes it gets, sometimes I have to work it a little bit. Um, I like to finish, it works on all surfaces. We did a car one time, me, Ivan, and Nick here at the shop, where we use this for everything and did an amazing job. I just like these two better. So you can't go wrong. Uh, Price-wise, this is phenomenal. Uh, this for a gallon was affordable. Um, this is pretty pricey at 29 bucks, but it's totally worth it. Category on the list is carpet cleaning systems. Honorable mention PNS makes great carpet cleaning system. Shine Supply makes it, but I'm only gonna have one for this category here in the shop because I put it as the buy it now or get it now of 2023 award. Uh, this, this two pH system from Lavo Cosmetica, Glico is an acidic. Uh, Doctale is pH. The cool thing about Doctale itself is it has carpet fabric softeners, enhancers, and it does good at cleaning. The acidic one makes it soft, brightens it up. The wild thing about these two is that I put them against the other three, uh, the other two systems that I were using, and nothing touched these. Nothing. Nothing in that category absolutely touched these at all. So with two chemicals, I get the inside of an interior, even with a dry extraction, I could do it with a, an extractor or steamer. I could get them looking right and they were phenomenal and cleaning 
and the ability. So if you're looking for an amazing carpet cleaning system, La Voz Cosmetica 2-pH system is untouchable for 2023. I say that wholeheartedly. No slight to the other two. I think PNS carpet systems for the price is tremendous and Shine Supply for their price is phenomenal. So these two, bussin, bussin. These are the top pick for 2023. Nice list for interior carpet cleaning. What's, all right, so in this category is, is a weird one because we could get a dedicated wheel cleaner, which you have ADS, Envy Purge, uh, and then you could get a dedicated tire cleaner, which is ADS, Undressed from Yum, Undressed from PNS, uh, Wise Guys. We have all those, right? But for me, I just wanted to keep it, keep it real. These would probably be the only three that I would use as my all-in-one cleaner in the shop. And that's what I want to share with you today. So for a wheel and tire cleaner combo, um, my favorites of all time, Get It Now Award is Labo Cosmetica Wheel, I mean, Maniac Line Wheel and Tire Cleaner. It could be diluted one to 10, one to five, one to three, depending on the grime. It cleans, it's amazing. I love the smell. This stuff is tremendous and it's affordable. Uh, my number two pick, you could buy this in any shop or any, you could buy this in any store, basically, uh, is the Adams Wheel and Tire Cleaner. Uh, it's pretty aggressive at a pH of 13, but it cleans phenomenal. It cleans the tire, cleans the wheel phenomenal. It's affordable. Sometimes you get on Black Friday deals for 30 bucks. Stuff is great. We all know the PNS. I do. This is a new gallon. You see, I haven't even used it in a while. Um, this is a new gallon of PNS. This stuff is for the cost, for the usage of it, is a great wheel and tire cleaner. It's third on my list uh, for the 2023 nice list. Um, what I love about wheel and tire cleaners is I don't have to have the smell of iron. Um, I hate that smell. Like that's my biggest pet peeve in the world, but I think there's a company that solved that for me. But these three are my top three wheel and tire cleaners of 2023. 2023 nice list. We're going to go over this category of APCs. I am missing one. So my number one APC, I'll put a picture here. I can't find it or we used it all. That's probably why I can't find it. It's American Detail Garage F-Bomb. Phenomenal, one to 10, one to 20, one to 15, one to five. It's, I've been using that one for years and I absolutely love it. It is my all time favorite APC. My second for all time favorite APC is uh, Kraken. Uh, I like my second favorite for all time APC. I do have a gallon of stuff, uh, it's all clean. Uh, all clean from DIY details. You can use a 115 for the exterior, 130. It has great cleaning capability. We did use this on carpet once. It did a great job on carpets. Um, and then my third is Kraken by Phoenix ELD. Tim um, actually put me on to that. I do, I am starting to like it more and more. We'll see where it lands next year. What I like about it is the dilutions, the affordability, and I could use it for anything, right? So when you're looking at an all-purpose cleaner, uh, Doctale is an honorable mention. You want it to be used for more than one thing, right? That's the reason for the word all purpose. <laughs> you want it to be able to be good at everything. Um, and then you want it to be affordable because there's some APCs that are wildly expensive. These three that I mentioned are my favorite of all time. Some honorable mentions is Doctale and Drive Auto MPC. Want to go over my favorite window cleaner of 2023, I've only put one on the list. I wanna explain the why. Stoners, amazing, right? Stoners have been around for a long time, they make a great glass cleaner. Um, Drive makes a great glass cleaner, but nothing holds a candle to Nitido. I have said it once, I know people have reviewed it online. Uh, Nitido is amazing. It has uh, gel technology, so you spray it on, one spray, you can clean the whole glass, doesn't matter what rag you use. We're so used to or accustomed to using glass rags to get the best performance out of not streaking and things of that nature. This, I can use whatever towel I want and get the same result as I were using my two glass towels. Nitido is the number one, the only one I'm showcasing for 2023 as the best glass cleaner. Um, it has the Buy Now of 2023 award. You wanna get this now, link in the description below. Save yourself some time. The other category that has only one in it is the iron remover. The best iron remover of 2023. I want to be careful how I position this. Do I feel like there are better iron removers in the space for 2023? It depends. Depends what, what do you consider better? Do you want it to be more pink? Do you want it to, what, what, what makes a great iron remover? And then let me know in the description below. But for me, 
The best iron remover 2023 is stoners. I didn't use it outside on concrete. For my experience, I used it on dirty wheels. I got great results. I got the orange, it cleans, it has surfactants. I use it for a clay bar. I use it all over the car. I have already used the gallon. Uh, this is the one I want in my box. Uh, this stuff, phenomenal. It is absolutely tremendous. It's probably one of the best iron removers in the game. And the thing that took the cake for me is it doesn't smell like poop. So this one doesn't smell like rotten eggs. Phenomenal. Category is the best, it's the best panel preps of 2023 that made the nice list for me. Um, one of them were newcomers, They're actually both newcomers. Uh, my favorite panel prep for the last three and a half years was Clarity from NV Car Care. Clarity makes some of the best panel preps I've used for a couple reasons. I can use it for glass. It was amazing. It doesn't streak. I've, it's just the go-to that has been so good to me for a long time. I've used Gion, I use Eraser. I've used several other panel preps um, and I always gravitated back to Clarity. It's changed. I want to really emphasize the why it changed. Uh, my number one is Peleus, Phoenix EOD. I won one and I bought one. I was going to put ADS as number one. I'll tell you why I didn't. There was a scenario where I had left coating on the car uh, for glass. Recently, we were, we were coating a Tundra. This bad boy, nothing would take it out. I mean, I polished it, it was still getting streaking. It was weird, man. It was, it was a Nazi all glass coating. You gotta be careful, that stuff is amazing. This stuff, sprayed it on, took it off. This Paleus panel prep is goaded. Uh, you're like, hey, what about Veritas? Veritas for me, it's amazing, but Veritas straight, I had to use to get the same results as Paleus ready to use. Don't know what's in it, don't know the difference, but that's the only reason um, I didn't put Veritas on this list. And then Armor Detail Supply panel prep, this one is phenomenal. This one right here is phenomenal. This one smells like mint. It has great cleaning capability. It does have surfactants in it. It looks like it has surfactants in it. Uh, it has a little foaming to get all that grease off. I use this on about two cars. Phenomenal. I'm actually still waiting for my gallon. I got lost eight times, but this stuff is great. Number one, this. Number two, this. But if you buy this, don't worry. You don't need to go and buy this. I say that because these two do God's work. They're amazing. So these are the best panel preps, 2023. Thing I, I'm gonna say Pan and whoever else does these 2023 videos, they take a lot of work. I actually had to bring every single chemical in, had to lay them out by order, and then I have to cut each portion. And I do that because I want you all to know, I probably spend 15 hours, uh, 15 to 20 hours a month testing products for various companies. So I don't just test the stuff I like, I test outside. So when I tell you that these are my favorite, I mean that. Um, when I tell you that they've been tried, proven, packed, and all that, that's Cars Plus, well, you'll get sued for that. Uh, I mean that as well. So our next category I wanna to touch on is our one-step polish. Uh, what is a one-step polish uh, versus a compound or versus a polish per se? Um, when we think of a one-step, right? We think of a polish that can be used as uh, one step to take about 50% of the paint and bring it back. Well, you're like, Eddie, you could, you could do that with a polish or a compound. Yeah, absolutely right. But these actually have amazing finishing capabilities. Uh, one of the, and they're all pad dependent per se. Um, and they cut and finish GMC black paint the best. That's how I measured this. So I want you to know that. This is how Eddie measured this all in one. Well, this one step polish. So my number one pick, 2023 nice list and i'm gonna say get it now is cartech 9000 cartech 9000 is out of i don't know if it's like the netherlands they're outside of the united states um this stuff is phenomenal it doesn't dust it gives you a nice rich clarity to the paint it finishes down amazing and it does god's work um, my second pick um, I should probably put this as, you should buy it now if you haven't tried it yet, is Ivan LaCroix and Nick McGirt's Gold Standard DIY. It smells like bananas, it cuts like a rape date. Wait, am I allowed to say that? It cuts hard. Um, there's a video that Brian Apex did where this thing cut ridiculously hard, uh, up to 600 grit sandpaper. This thing is ridiculous, it is pan dependent. 
Uh, it does finish well in GM black paint. It could be used with a rotary. It could use, be used with a DA. It's, this, this is all in one. This, is, this stuff is amazing. Um, and then last one in this category of a one step is drive automotive appearance, infinite gloss, all in one. You're like, it is all, all in one. This is pad dependent. Could be used with wool, could be used with the rotary, it could be used with microfiber, and it cuts as good as DIY does with any pad. Um, and it leaves behind a protectant ceramic, but you can also coat over this. So this is more like a primer polish. The reason I put this as a one step, because as a one step, this stuff is gnarly. Even if you intend to ceramic coat, you can still coat over this, no problem. It doesn't mess the ceramic coating up. It actually has, it leaves behind a layer of ceramic where you could just put the ceramic on it. This stuff is busting and it smells amazing. There, look, we're almost there. We got like four categories left, five categories left. Uh, it's been fun for me to see throughout the year, the things that I have tested, the things that have made the list, the things that have went off the list. It took about two weeks to curate all this, um, to take notes, to look through my notebook, to see which one I liked the best, which one I hated, the why. Um, so I'm excited for this one. I wanna talk about the best compound. When I think about compound, I'm thinking about cutting. I'm thinking about rotary cutting. I'm thinking about DA cutting. I'm thinking about 1500 or less sand grit cutting. I'm thinking about uh, a two-step. What I would grab first for a two-step and I wanna walk you through my first one. This one is the Get It Now Award. This one won the Get It Now Award. This one is phenomenal. This is Mafra. It is the family company of um, Labo Cosmetica and Maniac. Mafra Correcto 3.0 is untouchable. It finishes well, it does not dust, and it cuts more than, nine, and than H901, and it finishes better than H901. Mafra Correcto 3.0, it is doing God's work in the shop. My second favorite of all time of 2023 is uh, H902 from Coach Kemi. It cuts real good. It finishes okay, it doesn't finish the best out of these three, but it does cut real good. And uh, I, if I had this in the shop, I'm definitely not picking up this, but if I only could buy one and you're like, Eddie, what, you know, if I can only find one and I can't find correct, or which one would be my second pick, it would be H901. Uh, this one is, uh, this one is a dark horse. Fine Lab makes some of the best ceramic coatings in the market. You're like, he's just saying that, no, I'm for real. Uh, they make some of the best ceramic coatings in the market. Fine Lab released this about a year and a half ago. This is A, 50 super heavy cutting compound those words might scare you but you can actually use this with a euro 50 50 and get amazing cut and finish fine lab 3a50 it's an amazing cutting compound um, and these are my top three for this category the polishing right we cut it we just took the hammer to the paint we're like oh my gosh i gotta finish it uh, I wanna talk about my top three uh, that I would use and why. So I could've made this his own category where it's an all-in-one or a primer polish, but I did not because he's finished so well as a polish, right? The intent of a polish is to leave protection after or, or you're gonna go and you're gonna put ceramic coating is what I mean, right? Or you're gonna put a ceiling on top of it. So these things, these, these compounds here or these, these two that I'm about to talk specifically do not negate that. They actually help it. Let me talk to you about my number one pick. Go buy it now award, the get it now award, the goat of the bunch, Fiero. If you don't know about Fiero, you don't know about life. I'm not kidding, you know about life. Oh, relax, grab a seat, relax. I'm sorry, sorry. Fiero is from Labo Cosmetica. It leaves back a ceramic protection. It cuts, it finishes, it cuts okay. It finishes amazing. The gloss is amazing, easy to remove. And you could coat right over this without a panel prep. Fiero takes my number one spot. My number two spot in this category is Angel Wax Redemption. I freaking love this. I have used this for years and years. Angel Wax makes some of the best compounds in the game. You're like, Eddie, why didn't you put them on your list? Cause you know what? Even though I love it, um, there's some of the ones that dust. Like Resurrection, if you work it too long, it dusts a tiny bit. I'm not about that life. This is so good. Uh, one of my favorite compounds of all time or polishes of all time is Redemption. It finishes down amazing. You can use it on soft black paint. You can use it with a rotary. I've used it. A lot of my business and stuff is great. Um, a newcomer to this, and I've used tubes of this. I say tubes, because before they didn't have the big 32 ounce tubes. Uh, it's NSP 95. Now, yeah, NSP is unique. Um, it has no organics. It has no silica, no waxes. Can be used as a primer polish, so it leaves down a layer of protection. You coat right over it. You have to get used to the science because it's different. We're used to dabbing, boop, boop, boop. Three on a pad, you do that, my friend, 
and you try to put it on, it'll be way too much, and you'll be working it for way too long. And that's where people get frustrating, is when you don't understand how to use it. This, when you learn how to use this, some of the best primer polishes and polish in the game. Again, Dr. Billy's is 95. It's amazing. They are redoing the formula talking to Chris, so it should be more user friendly. But that is my top three pick for polish. Call it the wet coat or the wet sealant that could be applied wet. I'm gonna give you my top two. Um, there's three, I just don't have it in stock, but I'll put a link here, it's wet coat. My number one pick is Beneficia. This is a spray on, it is slick. It is uh, lasts a little longer in my test than wet coat. Um, it's easy to use and it gives it an amazing gloss. This stuff is tremendous from Labo Cosmetica. My next pick, my next pick is um, Quick Beads from DIY Details. Quick Beads has some graphene in it, so you wanna make sure you shake the bottle. Uh, Quick Beads also lasts about uh, six months in my element, up to six months. Uh, it beads amazing, it's easy to use. It's, you have to be careful because if you spray too much, you don't get it all out, you'll get some streaking. So these are my top two picks for 2023. Uh, Beneficia being number one, Quick Beads being number two for wet coats. Category, the best quick detailers in the game. My number one pick is ADS Amplify. It made the press all bottle. So if you make a bottle, you're goaded. Uh, that's just in my opinion, this stuff, it's slick, this stuff is easy to use. Not only do I use it as a quick detailer, I separate this category. You can use it as a drying aid, uh, you can use it in between washes, this stuff is great. This stuff is amazing. Amplify from Armor Detail Supply, it's my number one, it's actually a go buy it now. Uh, if you haven't had a quick detailer that you like, give this a shot, this stuff is amazing. My number two pick is Grills. Shout out to Tim for sending me this a long time ago. It's Ceramic Speed Shine. You can buy this anywhere, anywhere you can buy this. It is awesome. So this one here is from Grills Garage. It's slick and it lasts a long time for a quick detailer. It's pretty amazing. And then my third one is uh, Perfecta 2.0, quick detailer from Labo Cosmetica. I love this because even if it gets dry or there's a water spot outside, you can actually just reactivate it and it takes right off. So this stuff is great. Uh, it doesn't last as long as these two, um, but it does last a while. Getting into some territory now, right? We're about to almost wrap up the video. We got a couple more things. I'm excited for these parts because this is the part that I really love. Let's talk about drying aids. Now, I never used a drying aid before in my life. I would just use Rinseless because Rinseless itself is a great drying aid. You could put on the panel, get it done, right? But these three, these last, this last year, um, have been nothing but tremendous for me. Uh, why aren't they in the bottle? Because I wanted you to see the bottle for itself. I wanted to brag a little bit about Amplify, but one of the best drying aids to ever grace uh, EC details is Ceramic Plus. Stuff is expensive. It is from Owner's Prime Ceramic Plus. You put on one spray per panel. When it's wet, it's got like an oil type resin and you wipe it and it's just phenomenal. It is the best drying aid in the business. You wanna go get this. And the cool thing about this is that uh, it lasts a long time, like three months as a drying aid. Not only that, easy to use one spray. This is the product of 2023 for me for the best drying aid ever. Go buy now. Uh, my second pick is BC3 from Blue Collar. It is a sealant. You can dry it. You can't use it as a quick detailer. It is long term. But for a drying aid, I found this to be awesome. I love the smell. It's got like that fresh clothes smell. It's slick to the touch. It interacts with water well, and it's pretty affordable. Uh, Apex, uh, Apex surface, Apex surface protection. Brian's line, BC3. It's some of the best drying aid in the game. And then my third pick is Lithium Afterwash. Lithium Afterwash is slick. The reason this didn't get number one or number two, because I felt like this was a little more slicker than this. Um, but this one is amazing. Same way, you wash your car, you spray this on, you dry it. These are my best, these are my top three drying aids in the game. Uh, if I were running out of Ceramic Plus, because it is pricey, like $300 a gallon, you're like, what do you say? 300 a gallon. That's what I said. Stuff is expensive to make. I would just go to BC3 or Amplify, if I'm being honest. But these three, phenomenal. Our, our, our category of protection, we're looking at long-term sealants. I'm smiling because things have changed so much and a lot of you are gonna act like my cup now, the Grinch. That I wanna really walk through this and be mindful. I wanna say there's a lot of products out there that are amazing sealants. I have a crap ton of them. 
Um, I can name them all, but I won't. Uh, these are my top three picks, and I'll tell you why. Ceramic gloss has gone through three chemical tests. It's readily available, it's affordable, and it smells amazing. Ceramic gloss takes the number one spot. Uh, my number two spot, you're not gonna believe this, I don't believe it. Um, I had an epiphany, it was one Sunday morning, I was like 11, I mean, one Sunday evening, like 11 a.m. or 11 p.m., I went outside, I was like, you know what, I'm gonna get beat here with another shot. Uh, read the directions, Eddie. So I did it just like I said, I didn't let it touch water for two hours, and the stuff two months later in the snow, even after a heavy wash, is looking amazing. I love the way Bead Hero is looking. Bead Hero takes my number two spot from Dr. Beasley's as a great long-term sealant. Um, but these two don't get the buy now. Ceramic gloss I put as number one. It's readily available. It's easy to use. It's affordable. And it lasts a long time. It's made two, three chemical tests and it just survived. We're looking at like, Eddie, what the heck's wrong with you and Griots? Tim McLaughlin. Don't know if he wants me to say his name or not. It's always messages me about the funniest things. He'll say, hey man, um, you need to give this shot a shot. I go, why? He goes, trust me, give it a shot. So he'll just send it to me. When he was at my house, we filled up his Tesla with a whole bunch of chemicals and stuff. And he says, I want you to try it and give it a fair review. This was one of those products that I've used already two 32 ounces of is Griot's 3-in-1. I call it Baby Hulk. The stuff is stout. It's not the slickest in the world, but the beading on it is wild. It's phenomenal. The beading on that is phenomenal. Um, you can't go wrong with any of these three. If you're living in an area where you can't get Bead Hero, it's too expensive. I'm not gonna lie, dude. Bead Hero is freaking expensive. It costs more, I think, per gallon than Ceramic Plus does. This stuff is expensive. These two, affordable. This, you can get anywhere in AutoZone. It does God's work. If I were to give any one of these review, uh, the Go Buy Now review of Be Ceramic Gloss and um, Griots, because they both, like I, could, I was having a hard time picking. The reason I picked this is because I like how it smells better and I like that it doesn't, I could use it just spray it on, use it, don't have to do all this, spray it on, wipe off. I, I could use it as a drying aid. It does good as a drying aid. Not the best, but it does good um, in the last long time. Uh, I didn't give this the award because of the price and because if you don't follow instructions, you're a DIYer, this is gonna piss you off. Cause you're gonna be like, why is it not working? One day I did call it a no hero. Um, shout out to Dr. Beasley for further forgiveness, but this stuff does, is hydrophobic. This stuff is wild, love this stuff. So that's my top three sealants, 2023. Type, you know I love the smell of the E. If you watch EC details for a long time, you understand that. My favorite interior smells, uh, chemicals for 2023, are these three, and it was hard for me to pick in what order. So I'm gonna let you make your mind up. I'm gonna tell you why I like each one the best, and then you make your mind up, but I'm gonna give each one of these the Go Buy Now Award. Um, go Get It Now Award of 2023. Like, it's that good that you wouldn't be disappointed. Fresh AF bars from Bio Bombs is tremendous. It lasts a long time, it's affordable, and it's non, you can't see it, and it's not in your face. This scent, you put it in the car, you get a nasty girl to Carly. He's like, oh, it's not that dirty. But her kids threw up all over the place and you have to clean it. This stuff is legendary. This stuff, chef's kiss. Platinum Potion, it's made out of Australia, is a nice sprayable scent. This is a new car smell. This is mine and my girls' favorite car smell. You spray six to eight on the carpet square itself or the fabric. You close the doors, let it sit for 30 minutes to permeate. And then what happens is it lasts a long time. This stuff, tremendous. Touched by God. You can only buy it in one place, parkscarcare.net. I'll put the links in the description below. EC10 gets 10% off. Um, stuff is goaded. This is literally been around for so long. This is called Angel Wax Eden. This smell is so unique. It's so flavorful. It's so, uh, it smells so good that it gets my jowls going for something that I don't even know I want, right? And it gets my eyes like, hear the world, make it a better place. So when I spray this, all right, I'm gonna be honest. If you get this, for this, it's 25 bucks for this bottle. It's worth it. The smell is phenomenal. You don't wanna spray a lot. I usually do one spray, it'll last in the car a while, long time. This stuff is amazing. It's called Angel Wax Eden. These are my top three scents of 2023. Getting into the meat and potatoes of longevity, ceramic coatings, consumer. 
I want to talk about the consumer ceramic coatings. Um, one of them I don't have here because it was used on my passenger's car. I do want to mention it. Uh, I'm going to put a picture right here. It's Drive Automotive Appearance Quartz. That ceramic coating is amazing. Uh, it's $100 for 50 mils. You can do two cars with it. Super hydrophobic, super self-cleaning, um, and it works well. I'm gonna put that as my number three ceramic coating of the year. Uh, my number two is DIY Details, uh, three-year graphene ceramic coating, 59 bucks. It's easy to apply, easy to use. The cool thing about this coating, uh, it has super high gloss and it has some water behavior where it helps with the, I, I'm not gonna lie to you, I don't know what graphene does really. All I know is that you don't wanna get it on your skin, but this is easy to use, super glossy, super glossy. And so far we put it on the car uh, of my neighbors uh, and since they have came out, since I tested it, it's been going strong and she doesn't wash her car. How do you know? She let me see it once. I came in, I brought it, I washed it. I was surprised at the hydrophobics. This stuff is amazing. Uh, my number one for 2023 is Armor Detail Supply Ceramic Quartz. This is a three-year coating. It's in my test, so you can see it here. I used it on several cars, but never used it on my own. What I love about it is the ease of use. It does go on thick, certain wipe off. Once you start to wipe off, it gets super slick. It's got high solids and it does, does do what it says it does. It's super hydrophobic. I'm talking about super hydrophobic. Self-cleaning properties are great. It does God's work on a panel. The three coatings that I mentioned, this one, and I'll put the picture here, is probably some of the best consumer grade coatings you could get now without having to fight the bears for it. So drive this one, this drive ceramic quartz, DIY details, and my number one pick of 2023, it is the quartz. My favorite pro, right? My favorite professional grade coating. It's not even out yet. It's uh, Ivan LaCroix, Christine, have allowed me the honor of testing this coating on some cars. I do want to tell you that the, what I'm about to tell you is facts. No one has seen this box yet. Uh, Christine and Ivan let me uh, get one for helping them uh, do their initial test. And this is probably the best professional grade coating I have ever used. C6 Hydro. Go by now, you do have to become certified. This coating, the hydrophobics, the hydrophobics on this coating, it's mind blowing. The ease of use is bananas for professional grade coating. I'm talking about the ease of use is rivaling those of a regular consumer grade coating. The hydrophobics is nuts. The gloss, the jetting effect, this is the best professional grade coating of 2023. You're like, Eddie, it's not out yet. Dude, it's, I have it in my hand. Right here, it's my hand. Uh, you do have to sign up. I'll put the link in the description below. C6 Ceramics. Thank you, Ivan and Christine, for letting me uh, test this and last five times. Um, that's the number one spot. The number two spot for me is OP7. You do have to be certified. If Hydro wasn't, uh, wasn't around, OP7 would take the number one spot like this. I put it on my car eight months ago with uh, me and Ivan putting it on together. This stuff, phenomenal. Like. The self-cleaning property itself is, is, is wild. It's like, it's wild. Like if you want, if you're looking for professional grade coatings, these three are probably the only three I would, if you want an installer that I would probably buy in my business and use, cause they work and they work and they're easy to apply and they're easy to work with. It's OP7, tremendous. The last coating is Armor Diesel Supply, pro grade coating. I'm gonna tell you something real quick so you are aware that this stuff is, is thick. Uh, this coating is thick, super hydrophobic. The interesting thing about this is I've used coatings that claim to be high solids, but when you put them on, they were hard to remove. This one, when you put it on, once you start to remove it, it becomes slick and it's awesome. So these are my top three picks for 2023 for the best professional grade coating you could buy. There's nothing in the market that will rival any of these three, uh, in my opinion, um, from what I use, period. Um, about my favorite wheel ceramic coating, and I wanna talk about the why I picked these two and nothing else. 
in all honesty, it only would have been NB wheel, period. I would have stopped the video there, told you to go buy this now. It is amazing. But then Armor Detail Supply decided to come out with their stuff, the wheel coating from Armor Detail Supply. Um, I'm testing this right now, and I gotta tell you that I am super impressed. Not only that, you get 30 mils and you get 20 mils with NV. These are the best coatings for wheels on the market today. If you look for a ceramic coating for your wheel, you're like, what's the purpose of a wheel coating? Great question, Jamie the Cleaner. Uh, these wheel coatings, especially this one is what Bradley said, is they took it, it's not the most slick, but it'll be the most durable. So they put more carbonite, carbon in it, and they put more, uh, they just made it to, to resist a lot more dirt, a lot more marring, um, and allow for cleaning of the rim a lot better. Uh, when you put a ceramic coating on your rim, that's what you anticipate. It's for ease of use, ease of clean, and then when you're cleaning it, you don't get a lot of iron um, that could damage your wheel. Same thing with NV. So when you're looking at wheel coating, I don't care about the temperature. Every single ceramic coating I put in this test, you can put on your wheel, uh, but these were made specifically. The chemistry in it was made for the wheel, and they both work good. So these are my top two picks, 2023 of the nice list. And I wanna give a huge shout out to this company, Lithium Car Care Products. I, I used to make fun of, like when I saw a squeal and shine, I was like, the heck is this? No one's gonna use this crap. Or if I saw like a long time ago, like gloss, gloss some, some gloss wax. And then I got to know Bill. And then I got to start using the products. And then I started really deep diving into things that they were using. And then I started using this. Lithium cubes. If you're looking for the best trim ceramic and restore, ceramic, hear me out because Solutions Finish will always take king, right? You know that, I'm not even putting this video, just go buy it. If you're looking for the best ceramic infused trim restore right now, Lithium is the only one on my list. Lithium ceramic cubes are the best trim restore ceramics that I have used. I have used Fine Lab, I have used Bonix, I have used uh, G-Tech, I have used a lot of ceramic coatings for plastic and the only ones that I know that would restore and put a ceramic behind didn't really last this one is my last pack and i'm savoring it the stuff is tremendous lithium auto cube is tremendous so if you're looking for a trim cube that's it i'm going to do my last giveaway of 2023 uh, thank you for watching i want to thank you for just staying tuned jiving with me watching the whole video if you made it this far here's what you get to here's how you enter in the description below i want you to tell me which one is your favorite product product out of everything I said or your own and just put hashtag nice list 2023 hashtag nice list 2023 I'll put it here and then if you win I'll run it on Christmas Day and I'll just put it on my community post of who won just to win a bag of lithium cubes and then you're gonna get to win my favorite coating of 2023 for consumer is armor detail supply Ports. You'll get to win this, you'll get to win a bag of lithium cubes. And again, to enter, all you gotta do is tell me your favorite product in the description below. Put in hashtag NiceList2023. I wanna thank you for watching. I wanna thank you for participating. If you made it this far, remember you get to win two big, it's my last giveaway of 2023, these two. Uh, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification, and I am so excited for 2024, and I wanna thank you all. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas, be well, and thank you for staying tuned to our nice list. With that, I'm out.